All right, so big day today. I actually get to go pick up my new truck. So I'd ordered this thing a long time ago and it finally came in. Um, pretty excited. I sold my last truck and my Cadillac back in December so I could order something newer and reliable and be able to travel more with Dirty 13. Um, just not have any of the issues of trying to daily a 6.0 power stroke and you know travel for car shows so um that's why i ordered this and we're gonna go pick it up now so pretty excited i'll show you guys everything state forward that's where i ordered my truck from if that tells you what it is but uh yeah ordered it back in december it was december 28th i believe uh just for the end of the year and it's taken six months to get here i don't see it in the parking lot so it's probably still getting cleaned up they're gonna go take it put a tank of gas in it for me so we'll see we'll check it out i'm gonna head in here see what's going on things I've been really excited about it's the new sync 4 I don't remember how big that tablet is full touch screen you can run multiple things on it at once it'll cut the screen you can have your radio over here but I'm excited I fully built this truck out exactly how I wanted it I even got the I was able to delete the auto start stop so it doesn't shut off at lights saved me 50 bucks not mad about it I did get a tow package with tow mirrors and i love cloth interior i know people are all big about leather but with the xlt package that's all you get but i don't know just more comfy to me i do wish they had a black cloth option but the gray works it's actually darker than i thought it was going to be So yeah, I did order a super crew cab, which is the full four doors, 
and it's also got a six and a half foot bed instead of a five and a half foot bed which is going to help a lot with dirty 13 with towing the company around uh, before i had that f-350 super duty and i could fit everything in the bed like just perfect to go to car shows and set up a booth and i didn't want to lose a foot with this truck because then i really have to like skimp out on what i carry or start bringing a trailer which a trailer might come one day but we'll see um, but I'm excited. I got, so I got the bigger bed that's going to help carry everything. And, uh, it looks great. I love it. This thing is just beautiful. I didn't want to drive it and put any miles on it. You want to meet him at the front door? Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. I agree. I bought my first big truck. Yeah. So yeah, got the truck. I waited six months for it to get here, um, but I think it was worth the wait. I'm very happy. Already got the kiddos seat in it back there. Um, yeah, I built this truck out exactly how I wanted it, and I'm I'm happy. You know, that's if I'm gonna make a payment on something, I I want it to be exactly what I wanted. So when I was trying to shop around and find something used or even new. I just, I didn't want to settle. I didn't want to miss out on heated seats or, you know, this new radio. Um, and they all come with center consoles now, but I want the bench seat, you know? Uh, yeah, so there were some things I just wanted to order to make sure I got it how I wanted it. But it's here. I'm 100% happy with it. I love it. Don't even care to make that first payment when it comes, but, uh, but I'm happy. I did sell two vehicles to have money to put down on it, so it's not too bad. It's manageable. But yeah, this is actually the first time I've ever bought anything new. So I think the newest car I ever owned, probably the Cadillac, 05, nope. My F-150 was an 07. That was like 10 years old at that time. But yeah, first time buying a brand new vehicle. It's got 24 miles on it. I think it had six when I got it, but I picked it up and now I'm going to work and spend 10, 11 hours here working on garbage trucks to make that payment. But yeah, I'm gonna make another video uh, just kind of going over everything with the truck, some in and outs, what I think. Cause honestly, a lot of the videos I watched on YouTube about like pros and cons of new trucks, these dudes just like have high standards. Like it's crazy. Like I got this thing and some of the stuff people complain about on YouTube, it's like, I came from an 06 Super Duty with a 6.0. Like anything this truck does is just so much, so far advanced compared to what I'm, I'm used to. So I'm not too picky really, but yep, yeah, I'm excited. I'm going to work. All right, so I'm out of work and back to finish this video. Um, yeah, so what it is, I got a 2022 Ford F-150 XLT model. It's a super crew cab, so the full four doors and a six and a half foot bed. There is the, it's called, I guess the Chrome appearance package. Um, so it came with LED, headlights or should be all lights around it's got I'm trying to show you this big old freaking radio i love so much heated seats uh gray cloth interior i did make sure to get the bench seat i just like that better than um the center console it is the 3.5 liter eco boost so it's v6 twin turbo don't remember the power, but it's everything I need. But yeah, I'm gonna stop rambling. Um, I love this truck, I'm excited. I definitely plan on posting some videos of stuff I do to the truck. Like I said, I got parts stacking up at home. Um, but yeah, this is the new company vehicle. I love it. I'll keep you guys updated, but I'm going in this video here. Um, 
stay tuned we've got more events coming up so i'll keep you all updated on everything we have going on there's more clothes dropping soon i'm working on a summer line uh looking at doing tank tops if i can be happy with the design but i'm out you guys thanks for watching i'll keep you updated